Hey everybody, this is Dr. Jesse Jackson III, best-selling author and facilitator of the Don't Kick Em Out book and training series, answering a very challenging, uh, a very difficult question at times, and it is why is this job getting harder? Why is education getting so challenging? Why is this happening? And it's very direct. Number one, our students and our families are having more challenges in their personal life. And as our students, the people we're trying to help are having more problems, they bring those problems to school. Now, you put this in, in concert with our, a lot of our teachers are having more personal problems than ever before. So now if you put two folks that are having more personal problems, then what you're going to get is mayhem and, and a very inconsistent outcome. The reason why our program has been successful is because we are spending our energy on dealing with the personal side of the business. The people side of the business is the, is the, is the side that very rarely gets addressed. We, in our college programs, what we could do is we go through a process where we are trained at the, what we like to call the, 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 the physical side of the business, meaning the how to do the job, curriculum, uh, using technology, new ways to, uh, to create, to teach students. The part that we often lack in and, and is that we struggle is the people side of the business. And that is where you see principals fall out with teachers, teachers fall out with children, teachers fall out with parents, parents fall out with teachers. And this is where the gap in the business is. It's a personal side. And so our entire agenda has been to put our energy into the two sides of what we call that three-man pie that actually makes an excellent instructor. And let me show you how this looks. We call them the three mandatory teacher indicators. So one is that ability to manage behavior. Classroom management is a, is a mandatory thing and we often like to say, if the teacher can't manage the people they're trying to help, they, they have no chance to be successful. The second part of it is, is the teacher's knowledge of their core subject and of their ability to deli deliver the, the message and also the ability to plan for their subject. So knowledge of the subject, can deliver the subject, and can plan for the subject. And we like to often say, if you don't have that intact, uh, I, don't, I don't think I can help you with that, that part specifically. Because you have to know your stuff. I mean, when you get the job, you got to know your stuff. Everybody's growing, everybody's developing, but in this area, you have to show up with the content ready to go. Some people struggle with delivery. Okay, we can grow in that area, but you got to know your stuff. And that is a key thing that teachers have to know their stuff. And then the third part where I've really specialized in is helping the teacher to understand how to manage their relationship with coworkers and maintain their health and their personal relationships. So what we find is that when the, the teacher knows how to manage their relationship with their coworkers and there is cohesion there in terms of that workplace, we're gonna get a much better work environment and a teaching environment. What we find at most of the schools that have an overwhelming behavior issue, high levels of referrals, we have found that those schools, the adults don't get along. And they're, folks, I mean, this is, this is devastating because it's the truth. You see that there's a bad cohesion between the adults and what they do is the kids tap right into that negative energy, see that adults can't get along and that sets the stage for ongoing negative behavior. So until the, uh, we as coworkers really learn, you learn how to deal with your coworkers, you learn how to be a colleague. Without that, you're gonna struggle. So two of these I can help you with, classroom management I can help you. Learning how to get along with, co with coworkers, colleagues, and improve your own personal relationships are areas where we can grow and we can get better. But knowing your content, knowing your subject, and being able to deliver it is something you have to practice and gain knowledge and get better at. You have to get good at planning, and you have to be able to keep the schedule that your boss sets. Well, still to this day, here we are in October, I still have some principal friends. I've had even teachers get fired this year because they did not submit lesson plans. I mean, I don't understand. So it's like the discipline of planning is not there and you don't want to do it. So if you don't want to do it, you make yourself a part of the problem. 
These are the things that we have to bring to mastery. And when we do that, the job gets much, much easier. I'm Dr. Jesse Jackson III. Hope these things are helping you. I'll see you in the next video.